All right, we're gonna take a look at Love Me Do by the Beatles today. So the chords that we're gonna to need to know are G, C, and D. So we have our G, our C, and our D. But most of the song is G to C. Let's take a look at the strum pattern. All right, so the strum pattern that we have is gonna be down, 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 up, down. So we're, our timing is four, four time in this song, meaning we have four beats per measure. I'm counting this in eighth notes, meaning that we're counting at one and two and three and four and. Our down beats are gonna be played by the down strums on beat one, beat two, beat three. We're doing an up strum on the and of three and then another strum down on beat four. So it's gonna look like one, two, three, Feel free to practice just on that G chord just to get that, that strum pattern down. The song is, you know, at kind of a swifter tempo, so. This is a great one for working on your G to C chord transitions. Start off slow, though. Okay, so let's take a look at the layout of this song. And that strum pattern remains the entire song. All right, so first we start off with two lines of the intro. Then we get into, so we only play the intro obviously once. Then we get into the verse. So we see this closed repeat bracket here, and we play through all these lines of the, of the verse. We'll notice that for a bar, we have silence. So we rest for this bar of um, the verse. Then we come right back in on that G chord. Once we get through this to this C chord, we hit this repeat and we go back up to this repeat and play verse two. Once we play, we're going to do that rest every time through that, through that uh, verse. Um, after the second verse, we're going to play the bridge, which we're going to use that same chord progression. We go through the bridge twice, and then it basically does another verse and another bridge somewhere and forget how it ends but these are the parts to the song so let me play through the verse and I'm gonna show you what that rest sort of looks like so I'm gonna start on right here right on that G on the beginning of the verse so I have and four, one, two, three, and four. So that's one time through the verse. After that, I would go back and repeat it again and go through. The bridge is gonna sound like this. So it's that D, D, C, G, which let's... that's how the bridge sounds once again same strum pattern the whole way through all right good luck with love me do don't forget to like my channel or like this video and subscribe to my channel uh, you can buy a link to this chord chart in the description and I also give guitar lessons online through zoom so if you're interested contact me in my email in the description below thank you